Hello friends, welcome to Madhushri's channel. This is Recording Projects. So today what we are going to do, we are going to do a balloon burster game. So in this what we will see, this is nothing but we are going to do very easily like how we, we did in previous video like a space shooter finale like that balloon burster. Okay, we will see how. So this is how the uh, balloon buster game will be. Okay, now I'm gonna uh, press a space button to arrow. Uh, the arrow should come so only. Okay, see. And uh, you please notice your score is also uh, coming. And even you can. Uh, Hear the sound also. Whenever I'm uh, pressing the space button, the arrow is coming right like that only. So I think you know this is very very easy because in previous video uh, we did a space shooter finale itself. So this will be very easy. Uh, but in that it was like in a uh, uh, vertically but in this it will be horizontal okay okay we will see how so come to the coding prod now so this is uh, I think now the, uh, this all you know now variable play uh, variable game state means we are calling the play state and game state we all we use in this uh, it will be Mm, it will be somewhere else like here or anywhere it will be okay now uh, suppose like uh, if we no need this also we can write but we have when we are writing like uh, we are calling the uh, variable play uh, we are writing like a uh, game state is equals to play uh, is equals to is equals to play like that means uh, for that we have to write so I think I didn't write uh, it's okay we can also write like this nothing so create a space create a space nothing it's nothing but the background I know uh, that you all know the background image how to take so that's what we have to go to animation tab and we can go your new animation and we can go to upload image to upload any images or you need backgrounds means you can go and see your every background so I took from this only uh, in this which I took uh, in this anything ah uh, this one I took so uh, when I'm clicking like this it will be coming okay so I will delete this because I'm having already so background means this only okay next variable score is goes to zero uh, see I will say you once again Variable, you all will be asking what is variable, what is variable. I will say this. Variable means we are calling these sprites or objects or groups. Okay. So, variable play, variable game set, variable backgrounds, uh, variable score, variable balloon group, variable arrow group, everything, variable bow. We have to call means we have to do. Okay. Next. Text size 20. Uh, text size means the score uh, size should be 20 or anything else what size you need you can write how much big unit you can write how much small unit you can write okay so I have gave 20 to become uh, to keep in uh, medium so okay next we are creating a group called a balloon group and arrow group we are cre creating a balloon group and arrow group that is nothing but balloons will this is the balloons and sp when we are pressing the uh, space button arrow group this is arrow 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 okay so we are creating these groups okay so next we will see variable bow is equals to create sprite uh, that means we are creating a bow you know bow and the arrow right so this is the bow 
where all my mouse is moving this is called the bow okay this is the bow so we are creating a bow uh, animation bow sprite and animation okay next background white background color should be in white color next create edge sprites uh, create edge sprites means uh, we are always creating this edge sprites right so uh, edges uh, we are creating the edges to uh, collide it see the uh, bow is colliding okay next we have used here if game set is equals to is equals to is equals to play if key went down space spawn arrow play sound then balloon blast mp3 we will see this later now we will go to the group that how to do i think this all you know in how i said in previous previous video or that how to create the groups right okay we will see once again so function spawn balloon we are uh, we have to we call this is a group in line number 18 we called in variable uh, balloon group uh, we have created the group right so we are calling it so it is line number 85 okay and we called in 18 okay and uh, spawn balloon we have to also call this spawn balloon also right because this is the function name so also we have to call this spawn balloon where it is it is in line number 76 okay and not only in this uh, 76 um, I think it will not be yeah okay okay because this is ba balloon right okay okay uh, it will be in a, the we are calling the function in 85 line number 85 called spawn balloon and uh, we are uh, calling the uh, 70 in line number 76 as spawn balloon calling it and in line number 18 we are calling uh, balloon group to create the group okay so for still where I uh, teach you okay i have teach till line number 31 okay we will address this all okay now we will see what is this i will teach you once again okay so if world dot frame count percent 30 is equals to is equals to is equals to zero what they are saying 30 means like how means just easy thing Wait, wait. Wait a second. Hmm. Okay, now it's okay. Now see it came clearly. Okay. Uh, the balloons is coming in 30 uh, speed. 30 speed. The balloon is coming in 30 percentage speed. Suppose I will change for you as uh, 200. I will change you. It is not coming. It will come after some times because we have wrote 200, right? Then it will take the time. We'll shoot this. Ayo, pachuko. Ayo, no. Ah, we got. So it will take more and much time. Okay. So we will keep it as 30 itself okay now we see how much fast it will come see there are more i will be doing okay we will stop playing and we will come to the code now okay okay now we are creating in the group itself uh, uh we are calling a sprite so balloon we have, have to call the balloon right so and variable rand is equals to random number means uh, the uh, balloons uh, will be in randomly it's coming in random right so 
or uh, we are calling it as rand or uh, we can known it uh, we no need to keep as rand because variable name can be different different i will be keeping as num i a a b c t anything i can keep even code also i can keep but i can give it as rand also nothing will not be happen but when we are changing here in random we have to change here also because where we have given the where we have given the variable name it will also take here only but suppose you are writing your uh, code uh, for example you are writing your code and here you are writing in only rand means it will not take it will come an error i'll show you i'll, I'll show you uh, write and also show you wait i'll write uh, as code now see it's coming code is defined but it's not called in your program because we didn't call right huh we are just calling in the uh, spawn uh, thing right and rand hasn't been declared For, uh, what they're saying rand hasn't been declared it means the rand is not there and they are not calling so see see rand hasn't been declared oops we can't figure out what rand is perhaps you mean the string rand with quotes if this meant to be a variable make sure you declare the variable var rand see this itself is saying variable rand the answer it is itself giving us you have to give variable rand suppose you you because why means you have gave your code just write your rand why because uh, the variable name should be same and the uh, uh, this are uh, in no animation lab also it should be same okay see now nothing error be coming pachku 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 appachku pachku kachak 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 okay so i think till this you have understood and balloon dot y is equal to random number 10200 balloon dot x is equal to random number 52300 what is that means that uh, 1 to 100 1 to 100 uh, the balloons will be keep on coming okay from 50 to 300 uh, uh, x position x position from 50 to uh, 300 the uh, balloons will be coming as a random 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 in y position uh, from 10 to 100 okay so that's what and you know velocity very 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 easily velocity y means uh, the positive positive means it will come down negative means it will come up so positive number should be 2 okay next balloon dot scale is equals to 0.5 balloon dot scale you know right what is scale okay i will uh, give you on i want to ask you on question uh, for balloon dot we have to uh, see we have to call uh, we have to make uh, we have made this balloons very 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 small right how did we made like did we write like balloon dot uh, size or balloon dot scale in code it will come like a scale a balloon dot scale even see in this i think a ah, arrow dot scale because the arrow size can be small or big or anything so i have gave easily as 0.5 next balloon dot lifetime balloon dot lifetime means uh, balloon dot lifetime means it is a ending point balloon dot lifetime is ending point ending point so i think the, this will uh, maybe this will be the uh, ending point um uh, i will keep it um, i think this will be the uh, ending point um oh <laughs> where i will keep i think this will be correct like 200 like that okay do leave it i think okay so uh, till balloon dot lifetime is 200 that means ending point balloon dot group add balloon everything i have said in the previous previous video 
see in there clearly one second okay balloon group dot add balloon means we have wrote a balloon 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 right so we have to also call in the balloon group right so we have to write balloon group in balloon as uh, balloon group dot add like balloon group should be adding in the bar like a balloon do you understand like that only for uh, this also we wrote see easily everything i have uh, said you uh, okay and uh, uh, arrow dot depth is goes to arrow dot depth minus one means um how to say uh, uh arrow dot depth uh, minus like this uh, means how i'll say for you uh, see whenever um for example a uh, t-rex is running okay a uh, t-rex is running and uh, when we are pressing the space button the t-rex will jump right at that time clouds will be coming so uh, clouds when the clouds are coming the uh, t-rex should be jumping right but the clouds will not uh, visible uh, will not be visible when the t-rex is jumping so for that we have wrote like this okay now uh, you understood everything world at most five means uh, it should go like this okay Mm, next to uh, what should we teach uh, mm. okay now i'll teach you what is this uh, now you know about the two groups right okay um okay now i'll teach about uh game set is goes to is goes to play if game state is equals to is equals to is equals to play if key went down space spawn arrow play sound balloon blast dot mp3 what they are saying means uh, first whenever the, uh, now we are playing right so we have to write game state should be in play so when we are playing when we are pressing the space button the uh, arrow sh one arrow should be uh, leave right it should be released right like how we in a previous game how we was uh, releasing the bullets in space shooter finale space shooting 2 space shooting 3 like that how we were releasing in the uh, bullets like that okay uh, like that only we have to release the arrows so a uh, spawn arrow spawn arrow means it will take this whole function spawn arrow will be taking this own function here then whatever we are writing it will take from the spawn arrow function to a game state uh, play okay so next play sound play sound is balloon blast mp3 how means ah uh, here go to manage assets okay so click on the manage assets then uh, sh do you want to record the audio means you can also record the audio like first we have to give a name like uh, you can give any name so now i'll be giving just me because now i'm gonna talk right so hello hi now you see it will be coming like me dot mp3 see hello hi. ah see okay like that okay now from you you need up uh, you need to upload from your file means you can also upload from your file okay so uh, you uh, know till 41 okay now uh, from bow uh, 43 i will teach you bow spread bow dot y is equal to world dot mouse y the bow is uh, Ah, the bow is moving right huh so for that we are writing world on mouse by like that okay see see the ma bow is uh, moving where all my mouse is go going okay so like that world on mouse by so we are writing okay so now we will read from here and that's it so from here of from line 47 to 68 okay we'll read now 
so now we are writing like if score uh, is is uh, greater than 5 then background star set animation land how wait 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 i will check it mm. okay i will erase this now it will come okay see the uh, background we are creating a score in this time so we can write like this also okay see okay so we finished now till 51 okay now we will next go to 54 to 68 okay so uh, you know for loop right for loop means what to create a many things many things and to destroy and to add anything or anything to do okay okay now we will do from now i know the, that you know this line and everything now i'll just explain once again okay so variable temp so variable temp is equals to balloon group dot get i so we are calling the variable name as for the uh, for balloon group we are calling in for loop as temp okay next if temp dot is touching arrow group if the balloon group is touching the arrow group then the uh, balloon that the balloon group should be destroyed and the score should be adding like press one c see arrow group is gonna touch the balloon group now see i think that you can see when the arrow group is touching balloon the balloon is uh, destroying and even your points is also adding by one by one see okay next like that to only same thing okay uh, this all are same and temp one we are giving because if we gave temp itself no we will not take like okay and i variable i not only i i already said you not only variable name we i or a temp or anything score or anything we can give any name okay so i have just gave i okay and uh, less uh, balloon group dot length uh, that all is very easy just write like this okay okay now if temp one dot is touching bottom edge see the balloon group is touching the bottom edge the uh, balloons will be destroyed and the uh, wait i will just see see can you see the balloon is destroying and even the points are also decreasing by one minus minus one minus two minus three minus four five like this okay that's it and main 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 thing is 78 line number 78 drawing spreads some people will be writing all the things very 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 correctly but they will not write only one thing that is so called drawing draw spreads this is the main thing okay so i think this will be very very easy for you people now uh and this is easy by uh studying a coding so you can also develop a many many games very easily uh, do you want this games link okay i will give you in description click on that link and you can also play okay So thank you for watching my video and for subscribe my channel and like my share and share to all to learn this coding. If you are having any doubts, 
just comment me i will save you okay so thank you bye bye we will see in next video bye bye don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you bye bye